again, making commercial platforms more usable. Call 866-224-5422. Toll free 866-224-5422. Amp2.tv, the first and only internet television network that's truly plugged in. 866-224-5422. That's A-M-P, the number two, dot TV. The opinions expressed on the following sponsored program are strictly those of the host, guests, and callers, and not necessarily those of this station, its staff, management, or sponsors. Serendipity Consignment Boutique East is a treasure trove of beautiful designer goods. You'll find the latest styles of immaculate designer handbags, clothing, and accessories in brand new condition without the brand new price. Shop for Chanel, Gucci, Hermes, Prada, and more. Serendipity Consignment East is located in the heart a beautiful downtown Boca Raton at 111 East Palmetto Park Road, just one block east of Federal Highway. So come on out and accessorize yourself in designer style. Hello, good evening. You're good. I'm good. I really moved the chair. Anyway, good evening, everyone. Serendipity Style. I'm Lisa Stark, and I have one of my producers on with me again. Ah. Thank you. Beautiful Dawn. I don't know if you're going to say producer, client. Everything. Everything. You're my everything girl. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. The beauty of what happens between two shows is I get to go shopping at Serendipity, right? And you ran in. Yeah, yeah. (laughs) And she, you know, her foot is a universal. Like Cinderella. Yeah, it is, which is always amazing. You can wear a six, six and a half to a nine. Am I right? I don't know if I've gone to a nine. Eight and a half. Well, that's pretty close. Yeah. It's only a quarter inch. (laughs) With every half an inch, it's only a quarter of an inch difference. You know what they say, size. It's all about the size, right? Yeah, they do say that, don't they? But I can't talk about that. Anyway. (laughs) I love your shoes. If you are ever looking for shoes, designer shoes, you have to check out Serendipity. I love handbags, but shoes are my thing. I know. Accessories, because you know what? It doesn't matter what size you are. You don't have to take your clothes off. You just go in trying a shoe. If it matches, you get the other one. Or you go to the next sticker color, and you try the next sticker color on. That's what's so much fun. I look I for yellow and orange. Everything is sized by stickers. And you know what? Because of all of that that you just said, that's all I'm going to carry. Remember I mentioned to you, and you were a little sad about that. <gasps> I was heartbroken. I know. I know. You know why? Besides, I loved your clothes. Yeah. Is I thought you weren't going to carry shoes anymore. But... You oh, told no. me oh, you were no. going to I'm keep going, shoes. As a matter of fact, I'm ca- shoes, handbags, any accessory, all those beautiful scarves, and I happen to have one with me. This is, of course, this is not happened to be not for sale, but you never know. I can be tempted. <laughs> this is a Louis Vuitton scarf. It's really, really huge, big, and beautiful. It was, yeah, I was a little concerned that when Becky made the announcement that you were not carrying clothes yeah. anymore... I wasn't that you were only going to handbags that I wasn't going to get my shoe fix, but I get my no, shoe fixed still. Get, I would never, I would never. That's something that that's part of the accessories. There you go. You know, and uh, once again, today I got in about eight or ten bags, which I'm very grateful for. Um, and I'm buying them as well because I'm buying a lot of Chanel, Hermes, and the Louis the bags that I know are going to sell. What's this bag? This is a this beautiful is a color. Louis. This is gorgeous. I've had, I rem- actually, I remember having this in once before. This is the Louis. This is a patent. It's beautiful. Yeah. Put it, it more the, towards you so we can the, see it in the camera. Oh yeah. There you go. Oh, yeah. This is be- It's gorgeous. It's patent. And, of course, it's a, more of a neon. But it, it's neon, but it's not that It's almost neon. like a watermelon red. I don't know. It's looking orange on our monitor. Yeah. I don't know what it looks like at home. But, but it's not orange. It's, it's not really, orange. You're right. It is a watermelon right? red. Right? And it has the embossed LVs. The, you know, they're classic little monogram. But this is beautiful. And she also brought it in with a wallet. The amazing thing is it looks brand new. I know. It really does. That's the incredible yeah. thing about everything you have in the store is it looks, even those shoes I tried on today, those brown ones. Yes. They are brand new. Brian Atwood. <laughs> they really were. They, they are. They brand new. Yeah. Well, you know how fussy I am. I'm I know. very anal, fussy, crazy, fussy. And Where is Serendipity? It's at 111 East Palmetto Park Road, and it's a block and a half east of Federal on the north side, which is opposite Louis Bossie's. And actually, it's really opposite the fifth, third bank. I got very lucky today because when I pulled in, all the spots right in front of Serendipity were open. Yep. So I zipped right in, yep. tried on some shoes. Yeah. She has a beautiful new puppy. Oh, oh I have my such a puppy. Gosh. Oh, do I have a puppy? It's a little Yorkie. 
and it's three months old. Actually, I think 13 weeks old, and it's just precious. She is the most precious, She's called precious. what? Blue and tan, even though she's black. I think they call Yorkies blue and tan. Blue and tan. She's magnificent. Oh, is Her she coat. beautiful. She, I know we digress, but the thing is with serendipity, it's like being at your home because you've got Chloe. Yes. And now I have Coco. Coco. I named her Coco. And everyone is family when you're there. Yeah. You're yeah. on the phone, you sit down, you try on shoes, you put your purse down. Right. If you want something to drink or something to eat, we have that. And that's what I like. I like it. It's. I love this store. I have to tell you, you know, there are people that come in and they miss the other store, but this store is very boutique-y. Yeah. And I love it. It just has, it just eludes warmth and just beauty and it's, it's a very open, different it's feel clean. than your other store it's, it, yeah it's very clean and contemporary and you're doing all accessories all different yep. what's this little blue bag you this have? little blue bag is a valentino rockstead wallet bag and this is like a gorgeous would you say this is like a periwinkle blue a little bit mm, royal a little more deeper blue than periwinkle i was thinking periwinkle is a little more tealy okay maybe well, yeah. It's a beautiful it's just, blue bag. It's a beautiful well, you can bag. see it on screen. It's really beautiful. pretty, and it has it's gold. It's like a not a shiny, shiny gold though. The little rock I studs. I believe. Are so. they silver? No, I think. I'm getting know? old, Lisa. I am too. I can't <laughs> see. Well, what do you think? I think it's gold. Uh, I think it's like um. You know what? It's, it's silver gold. I think they're more like a pewter, but they are beautiful. And and it's it a funny. wallet. If you open it up, it is looks brand and incredibly it's in new. Look at this. Mint condition. Right? Amazing. Yeah. This came in yesterday. Yeah. Don't Mint ask conditions. me prices. I haven't even put them out yet. I'm not going to ask you prices. But then it's a little crossbody. And you know the thing is, as we get older, we need more than a phone. We need a lipstick or a lip gloss. You yes. need a credit card. I was talking to a friend today about um, needing mad money. I got a nail on my tire as oh. I was driving around today with a client. And some, we were talking to the girl. I said, don't you remember your grandmother always said to you, you need to carry at least $20 of mad money with yes. you, right? You always need... Some cash because you never know where you're going to end up. You right. never know if you need it. So this has plenty of room for some money, credit card, your that's keys, the, that's a phone. Truth. It's yep. really the perfect size bag. Yeah. Many times that's what I do. I don't like to, I might bring three bags to work with me. But when I go anywhere or go out or run around, I can't take it. I, I just carry my wallet, a key, and a credit card license. And that fits with everything. This is it, yeah. Yeah, this is really And the very, Louis Vuitton very is the same thing, the red. Yeah. Same size. It's and it's so a nice beautiful. You know, the wall that size wallet is really that really this. holds a lot. Look you can even put here. your I bet you can put right? your cell phone in there. That's what makes it so perfect. Yeah. You could fit your cell phone and you can even fit the bigger one. I yes. The plus would yes. fit in here as well. Plus 100%. a key, a lipstick, and you can still close it and you're good to go. Yep. Which, which is, is a perfect which size. Is, because yeah. sometimes I find when there's too many compartments, yep. you can't fit anything in it because your cell phone's a little too thick. Exactly. But that has, this is really you know, perfect. the gussets make that really expand beautifully. It's the gussets. Isn't it's it the funny gusset. what we remember? I got a nail on my tire and I'm thinking of mad money because you never know. You would never expect, but you got to get no, it. That really you got to do what you got to do. That's true. And this holds everything that you need. Yeah. What is that? Now this, I don't know. This is the Grand Shopping Tote. Chanel's Grand Shopping oh, Tote. Black patent leather. And just to, you know, I'll, I'll tell you after I finish this little story, but this came in. And it's it's the Grand oh, Shopping Tote. They stopped. I'm, I don't know if I discussed this before, but it sounds familiar. But they stopped um, making these in 2014. So you're bag. not able to. What's that? Look at the size of this I know. bag. They call there's there's a few different sizes. This one is called GTS the Grand Shopping Tote. GTS. That's what they call it. <laughs> GTS. And the one that I have at the store is very, very, very hard to get. The this is the patent, the black patent with silver hardware. The one Beautiful. in the store is caviar leather and it's the jumbo. It is the jumbo Look and I have people this that are bag. This for is that. So, this Chanel is absolutely magnificent, yeah, Lisa. It it's really black is. patent. Yeah. It looks brand new. Yeah. That it blows me away when anything I buy in your store, even when I walk around and try things, you would never know that is consignment. So yeah. people who go, "Oh, consignment." I'm telling you more and more people I know, more and more women in Boca Raton know you from shopping and it's funny because i love shoes you know and a lot of my friends love shoes and i yeah. say where'd you get them and they say serendipity yeah yeah because you have the best shoes thank you sweetie thank you yeah, and handbags you know. and this little bag i saw when i was walking out today oh yes it's i saw little. you go this to is. that you that's why me? i brought it 
anything purple, That's I think, Stella. is like... Stella McCartney. Is it real? I was yeah. wondering what McCartney. it was. Stella McCartney. And Stella McCartney, as you might know, this does bag. not... She's vegan. So she doesn't make anything. She doesn't use leather at all. So what so is every, this? this is, everything is like a synthetic or... She, yeah. She, this is not what you... It doesn't... It appears to look you like know, I'm python. I'm so glad you said that because when I looked at it, I thought, ah, a purple python bag that large. I no, went, uh. No, it's not... And, and this one is this one is a little bit more special, as I would call it, more special. This is ha, this is more of a tote. Usually, the bags that I see you can carry different ways. It would fold over, but this one, and when you take out all the stuffing in there, it really squashes down, and it's it is, nice and soft and mushy. It is and, so lightweight, yeah, yeah, even with the hardware on it, because it's whatever. It's Her made bags of are always light, and light is very very popular now. Light. Is more comfortable. Oh, and there's a little treat inside. I oh, feel I like I'm in a Cracker that. Jack box. Yes, and look, and look what's inside. Yeah. <laughs> it's like it's a little well, Chanel wallet. And it's on the inside, wallet. look at that. Is that magnificent with the hot pink, yes. neon pink inside? Yeah. yeah. You know, if you're like Cracker Jacks, you go in the bottom of the box, and what do you find? Oh, in this, I find a Chanel you wallet. Do, of course, only in only For, with only my with store. Lisa would I find a Chanel only wallet at the with bottom me. of a Cracker what Jack box. Now you're looking to see if there's anything else in there. down here, right? This is also a pretty little... As one, as I said one time, it's pretty little diddly. Remember pretty I said little that diddly. diddly. <laughs> this is a Versace. It's pink, Versace pink face, pink band, and this. You know what? I just grabbed it. I swear, I grabbed everything and ran out of the store. It's incredible. Tell me about the colored watches, because you know people. Listen, I always wear color, so for me, I, I wear a pink watch all the time. Yep. But there are some people that are classic metal or the black. Who would gravitate towards a pink you know what? A and lot gold? Of people, a lot of people like pink and gold. Pink. They like pink, pink, pink. But that's a pretty pink. That's that's more of a rosy pink. It look, it's a ro and it, almost looks like a rose gold. Yeah, it's very feminine, and it's got a nice sized face, and um, yeah, that I like. Your Some, clientele amazes me because people buy and they wear, they don't, and yeah. then they bring it to you and you, they sell it. They can reinvest it. So yes. if you have things at home, don't think, oh, my gosh, I bought this in the store and I never use it. Or, you know what, I don't want it anymore. Yeah, yeah. Contact Lisa because, you know what, someone else is going to want your treasure for sure. At 561, I'm going to give you my number, 561-338-0656. You should give out your number here so people can call and I find out what's what? going I on. Should. You want to know what it is? What is it? 888-888. 565-1470. And please call. <laughs> give us a waiting. call while we're sitting here. 888 Five six five fourteen seventy. Thank you. It's right up there. Oh, there it is. Fourteen. You know, I, I think one man's trash is another man's treasure, but yeah. no one. This is not trash. This no. everything is magnificent. Yeah. And you know what? It's another treasure trove. When I find these beautiful Pradas, the shoes I wear, people stop me all the time. I know about the shoes. And you know, I was telling the story. I've been telling this, this story a lot when I first opened back in the nineties that people didn't know from consignment. Right. They didn't know. They knew from thrift. They knew from Goodwill and the Salvation Army. There were very few consignment stores around, and people would walk into the store and they'd say, why do you have these different makes, different designers, different Barbara Katz's, Barbara Katz's label were on several pieces. I said, this is a consignment store. Well, what is that? They didn't know what it was. So I said, other people, other people, other people wore these clothes. Boom, they were out the door in two seconds. And then it started to catch on. And then the handbags. I told you about how Louis Vuitton, you know, they sent people in to kind of say, you know, you're not allowed to sell. Mm. And then I realized, wait a minute. If you purchased a Louis Vuitton bag from the store, why can't they bring it to me to sell it? Right. What did you do? I said, show me the paperwork. They so couldn't they show it to me. So I realized what was going on. And... Uh, that was a long time ago. Now look what's going on now. You know, and I know your store has changed. And I just yes. want to, you know, the elephant in the room. Let's just get the elephant in the room and just address it. Thank you. Your store has changed. Yes. You moved from a very large location yep. where you were in Central Boca. Now you're east and it's much more boutique -y. But this change is for the better for you. It does. I'm very happy. So <laughs> let's talk about the change. Yeah. It is more accessories. It is high-end accessories. It is the handbags, the shoes. The jewelry. Things you think of accessories, jewelry, watches, yeah. scarves. Yep. 
She's just not having clothes anymore, but Lisa is there. When Lisa's so there, she has an extra baby with her now. She now has an extra dog, yeah, so she's yeah. going nowhere. Yeah, thank you, because people get crazy. They panic. They come in. I had a woman the other day come in and say, you know, she looked around, and she couldn't believe it. It's so funny. People don't like changes. Some so, than others do, because I have a lot of people coming in. I, they love the store. It's wonderful. And most people think it's a fabulous idea that I'm not carrying clothes anymore. I hear that all the time. What are they saying? Because the bags. People are more interested in handbags and the accessories. It's become that kind of a market out there. The industry has changed drastically. How has it changed? It's because it's more of an uh, there's more of an online presence, and people are shopping. It doesn't matter whether it's consignment, handbags, groceries. I don't care what it is. They're going. They're leaning more towards online. It's an easier lifestyle for people. Yeah, it is. But there are still many, many people who like to touch and feel. See what they're getting, um, authenticate, you know, make sure that everything is authentic. And they still like to come into the store. They still want the shopping experience. And the difference is, and I buy a lot online now, and even yesterday I was buying bathing suits. I bought $300 in bathing suits, and I know half of them are going back. And that's the pain in the neck. And it's a pain in the But with shoes and with your handbags, yeah. they're so high-end, you want to touch them, and you want to feel the leather and the suede yeah. or the Stella McCartney bag. Yeah. How it feels like python and it's not right. to actually experience it and it's that instant gratification of knowing it not like a bathing suit or getting your lingerie ladies where you can take it send it back it's not the same right you want that experience yeah. the boutique yeah. and the big the malls and all, all those big stores they are so overwhelming at least for me yes and when you work all the time yeah. who has the time really to go to the mall and walk around to go into 500 stores yeah yeah to find something and even the mall is changing the department stores are changing. They're not, you know, they're suffering at times, too, because of the same situation. So, you know, I'm happy where I am. I love my boutique. I love the area, the neighborhood. And I see that blossoming. And people are loving coming into the store. And I have a whole, you know, I'm tap it's so interesting. I've tapped into a whole other area that I didn't even realize that when I say, oh, have you ever been into the store? No. And so it's, there are brand new people all over, and they're moving in, and the buildings near me, and the condos and apartments. It's a fen it's phenomenal. The East Boca is a great walking area. Yeah. Yes, you've got the new condos that are right there. New restaurants are popping up. There's a up. new seafood restaurant that I ate at celebrating my mother's birthday with my daughter. And it's right down the street. It's right before, it's about a block and a half before the bridge on Palmetto, on East Palmetto. And it's on the right side of the road. And it feels like I am in the Keys. Really? Oh, it's so you really have to try this. Excellent. There's a big porch. Um, it just feels very. Oh, it's, it's wonderful. The uh, the fish is phenomenal. I don't I don't know the name of it. I can't tell you that. But it's it's right before the bridge, about a block before the bridge on the right side of the road, and it looks very uh, Key Westy. He spoke is really developing, and I it's, love where yes. your location is. Yep. And the boutique, and Lisa's always there. You just have to walk in and ask. I met your new yeah. love, Denise. She's lovely. Oh yeah, lovely. she's wonderful. She's fabulous. She has really been an amazing addition to the store in many ways. In many ways. So she's managing it. She's managing the the back. She's getting everything. Just it's just great. She's, and things are changing. Wonderful. I went in. I tried on. I looked at the clothes, the yeah, shoes, yeah. the handbags. Yeah. And really, when you go in, don't ever say, "Oh my gosh, I don't like that price." Just talk to Lisa yeah. or Denise or who's ever there. Yep. Yeah. Because Lisa is always willing to work with you, yeah. however she can. Because yeah. I made that mistake many, many years ago because I had bought some clothes. I didn't even know you back then. Right, I walked in right. to buy a gown. Yeah. And I cut the gown down. I made the bottom of the gown yeah. a jacket. Yeah. And then I went back in and I said, oh, I don't know. I don't think I can afford some of these things. Right, right. And then I met you and yeah. you said, ah, don't even look at that. Yeah, yeah. You said, just talk to me. I and usually, that was the best thing ever. Yeah. I usually say to people when they come in, this is what I tell people. Put everything you want, whatever it is that you're interested in, put it on the counter, and we'll talk about price afterward. And she truly does that. Yeah. So go in, enjoy the experience. You even do private nights. I know you just oh, did, yeah. what, a sip yes. and shop? Yes. I did a wonderful little private night on Friday night. It was wonder It was great. It was great. There was a nice turnout, and we had a lot of fun. And I'm planning more. So, I, you know, you can call the store if you ever want to do anything at 561-338-0656. And I do a lot of charities, too. I get like know. a girls' night, a shopping night. Yeah. Birthday night, charity night, 
dog night. Maybe I should have a dog <laughs> night. Have everyone bring their babies to the store. That would be, be inter- that would be very interesting. And your dogs are so. I mean, they're such amazing dogs. Yeah, I know they're so and sweet. Chloe, what kind of dog is she? A cockapoo, cocker spaniel poodle. She is just so easygoing, Isn't she and this sweet? new little Coco. Oh my gosh, Coco I'm is beyond. so cute. Oh yeah. And yeah. everyone's just laid back. And you got a phone call today from a new customer while I was in there. And she just took the time. She sits down. You got her address. Yeah. yeah. Let people know that you'll go to them. Oh, that's very, thank you very much. Because that's what I'm doing in the morning. Oh, I have a good one to go to in the morning. Yeah. I'm not even she won't give the address no, away. No, I but... won't give anything. And I, I just know I have an appointment in the morning. And I believe I'll be, it's a handbag appointment. So, so how does that work? Someone can call you and say, Lisa, I've got a closet full. Yep, I'm going over there. And I always say, you know, since the movie, the gray, the gray movie, but <laughs> 20 Shades of Grey, but I always like to discuss things so we're on the same page about prices. I don't always do 50, 50, 60, 70. I just will discuss, okay, what are you looking for? And, if they ex- and then we can discuss the expectations on both of our sides rather than, you know, say 50 50 because sometimes you you know the, the consigner doesn't want to do 50 50. it's so nice that you go to the house though, oh because i do when that you yeah. think about you're cleaning out your closets and you've got so much it's stuff it's, it's overwhelming. overwhelming and then you have to load it in your car and you don't do it and then you yep. want to bring the assignment store and you don't do it next thing you know you just give it away yeah. and that's not what you should do no i mean no. if you want to give it away but goodness you can take it reinvest it in yourself yep. the proceeds and lisa will work it out and she will come to your yeah. home and help you go through everything. And lately, people have been finding what they're looking for in the store. They come into the store, and they'll say, oh, that's a, I love that bag. And then we'll just, you know, okay, well, your bag, and my, we can just work it out where I buy hers, and she buys, she gets from the store. Oh, that's a nice deal. Yeah, it sounds yeah. like a Becky deal. Yeah, well, it is totally like a Becky, Becky deal. Wanting right, to do that. I know, Lisa, I know. let me go in and try this dress on, right. and we'll do this, yeah, and we'll do that. Yeah. But it's a great idea. Because I try to work with people. I mean, I always feel that I want to work with people as I would like them to work with me. So that's how I look at things. And you've been in business for how many years? 23 years. I opened at the end of 95. Wow. Yeah. This is your third third location? This is my third. My third location. Incredible. And it's going to be one of my best locations. Yeah, so she's not going out of business. She's just changing. (laughs) The marketplace has changed. Yes. As soon as you make one little change, right away, gossip, gossip, gossip starts. You know, but that's not happening to me. I am not going out of business, and I'm not going down. And I'm going. And it's just getting better. And tell people about parking. Parking, okay. Parking. First of all, a lot of people, there's parking in the front of my store, but people don't realize that they, those are parking spots. There's parking there. There's parking across the street. I'll even pay for your valet. <laughs> I will. I'll pay for the valet. I've done that a few times already. So they they park across the street at the Hyatt. They just go in on the side of the building. There's valet. They park there. Bring me your ticket, and I'll pay for it. Or they can park in the back on the side. Actually, they can go down First Avenue, so they can look there. And then they can go in the back. I have a little parking lot back there. You have to be careful because the man next door gets a little crazy. But there is parking. There's parking. And if you can't find parking, call Lisa, and she will direct you where to go. She'll get your car valet. Yeah. Just go in and experience it because she is so kind and so giving and Thank the store you. is so welcoming. Thank I love you. all the little snippets you put around. Yes. So yes. people see when new merchandise comes in. Yep. Absolutely. So I'm always, you know, you can look on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram. Um, there's always, you know, look, there's. What else do you have? I have. I, don't, I know you I came a with a whole of, lot of things. This is just a little Gucci That's bag. Like, it looks like a vintage Gucci. It's a little Gucci bag that every, people love Gucci. Gucci is very strong in market is it really yeah yeah it's just a classic you know it's you don't have to worry about the reds and the blues and if you're just a classic it goes with everything this happens to be a beautiful bag yeah it looks like a throwback bag and i don't even know if it is it's just the gucci pattern it's nothing fancy it's It's just your classic gucci i grabbed it brown and ran in and And it's really lightweight lisa and it's it's a perfect size i'm just gonna leave now wait my bags have bags (sighs) I've had oh my these goodness! These are the Christian Louboutin. Wow! Now look at this. Look at that platform they and heel. They are gore. If I had to walk in these, I think I would just fall over. But this is such a magnificent. I'm looking at the size underneath. I'm thinking, oh, can Cinderella squeeze God. her foot in there? I know. <laughs> but you know what? This is all platform. This well, is. I was going to ask platform. you that. So actually, when you this is this is as See? high as 
it cuts it right down. The heel is only a couple, maybe two, three inches, let's say. The platform is tremendous. The, the platform. platform is about three inches. Yes. It is a gorgeous shoe. This is some shoe, I'll tell you that. That is a beautiful some shoe. Some heck of a shoe. <laughs> really, yeah. It's funny. When I was in today, I saw you had a line of Louboutins in yes. all different colors, yes. which is probably from the same person because it, it was it the is. same size. Yep. You can tell people's style. Yeah. yeah. And I thought, wow, imagine her closet. Yeah. And how lucky are we that we now get to go into your closet I know. and see everything lined up, which is beautiful. This okay, is like let's a take closet, a look at actually. it. It's like a closet. Yeah. When you go in, it's a treat. You say, okay, what am I going to wear today? All right. Yeah. I could squeeze into these. Yeah. You could definitely look at these squeeze shoes. Into oh, my I gosh. Know. I know. A long time ago, I got a phone. Someone took a shoe like this, and they decorated it as like a phone really? holder as oh, a joke. Oh, that's cool. Well, this is now a real shoe, which yeah. is really yeah. unbelievable. Actually, it could be a phone holder. <laughs> I think I've seen those phone holders, too. Isn't that funny? Are, yeah. And yeah. it was painted, and it was just incredible. But the shoe was just absolutely magnificent, yeah. Lisa. Oh. The Louboutin. I mean, people have worn this. On the bottom, you can tell. You yeah. know, and there's a saying. And some of them aren't. Or they say people, like you don't want to walk in someone else's shoes. But you know what? If that other person has good fortune, why not? Well, yes. Why not why share not? in their right. fortune? Yeah. Like, why would people say it's a bad thing? Let's turn the tables and, and you, say it's a good yeah. thing. And you know what? Nowadays, right? all this is accepted. It's, it's, it's really consignment. is accepted all over the place. It's universal. It's universal. And you know what? Just be you and enjoy the moment. If you can yeah. enjoy some of these beautiful treasures... Hey, I went into Stella McCartney and I found a Chanel wallet. I'm still looking at the Cracker Jack box. That's it, the Cracker Jack you know, box. Enjoy life, enjoy everything because yeah. it's all affordable at Serendipity. And you just feel so special when you grab a beautiful handbag or you put on a beautiful pair of shoes. Thank you. Thank Amazing. you. Amazing. What's yeah. your phone number again? 561 338 0656. And I'm relocated at 111 East Palmetto Park Road. Block and a half east of Federal Highway on the north side opposite Louis Bosses. Thanks for having I'll me. I'll see everyone there. Bye-bye. There's the store. Bye-bye. Thank you, Dawn. Have a good evening. I'll see you next week. I know. I'm going to try to Lisa. Let's try it. Thank you for watching Serendipity Style. I hope you enjoyed our show tonight, and I look forward to sharing with you again. Please visit Serendipity East, now located at 111 East Palmetto Park Road, Boca, one block east of Federal Highway on the north side. See you next week. Have a good evening. The opinions expressed on the